Hey there, welcome. In this video, we're going to talk about using the free Elementor page templates from Emberium. Before we dive into that, I wanted to quickly cover who this video is for. If you're somebody who's interested in learning more about these templates and how they work, we're going to cover that throughout this video. If you're somebody who's interested in building your own membership site or online course yourself and you want to save some time, these templates will help you do that. Throughout this video, we'll show you how you can take advantage of these templates. Additionally, if you're a freelance web designer or Infusionsoft consultant, you can use these templates to quickly build membership sites or online courses for your clients. And you want to see more of these templates? We'll show you that through this video. Alright, so throughout this video, obviously we're going to show you what these templates do and a preview of what they look like. We're going to then show you how you can get these templates for free and installed on your site with Memberium. These are available for any new or existing Memberium customers. Before we move on, I should mention all the pages on the site also use these page templates. You can have these same page templates installed on your WordPress site and be able to set up a similar looking site very quickly. So with that said, let's dive in and take a peek at what they look like. In total, there are over 24 individual page templates that we give you on your site. If you're someone who would prefer to scroll through a blog post on these templates, we've included a link below this video where you can check out the same post and it will walk you through each of the pages individually. Here in this video, we're just going to skim through them pretty quickly uh, to give you an, a quick idea of what they do. Okay, here's a breakdown of the same demo site that we're on now. Here's our homepage. We have it set up a certain way since we're using LearnDash. We're using the LearnDash course grid add-on. We've modified it with them to include these lock icons, uh, or it'll have a check mark if the course is completed and I'm logged in. Uh, but by default right now, since I'm logged out, I don't have access to these courses. And if I try to click in to uh, this course I'm taken to the excerpt page or the members only page you get the same template and anytime somebody doesn't have access to a certain page or area of your site and they try to click into it they will be sent to this default excerpt page. Uh, we'll set this up automatically for you if you do request a free install. If you want to change any of the details here you can change the text or the uh, link uh, that you send members to for instance you could send them to your sales page or if you want to send them to an opt-in page for some type of free course they can opt into, you can do that. Uh, here's an example of the login page. Uh, this will be set up for you. There's also the forgot password page that's very similar. If you want to include free access to your site, there's a Memberium shortcode that allows you to register users where they can sign up for free and get free access. The cool part about our page templates is they're all linked together. For instance, we'll set up the login page on your site. Not all, all these pages will be linked uh, together automatically. Let's log in here and take a closer look at what that looks like. So now you can see I'm logged into the site with the LearnDash course grid add-on and the progress tracking. I can quickly see where I last left off in the training, which courses I've completed so far and which ones that are left. And by the pages being linked together automatically for you, I mean all of the pages in the Your Account page are linked together. Uh, for instance, if I wanted to add, update a new credit card, this is updated. After they submit it successfully, they'll be sent to the page that says, hey, you updated your credit card, thank you. You can view any of your past paid invoices. That page is already linked and added to your site for you. If you want to allow members to self-cancel their subscriptions, they could do so there. Also in the Your Account area, if you're planning on using the parent-child add-on, we already have this set up for you here where you can invite and add additional members to your site. This page is already added for you. Also the page where they can invite and add new users, that's already linked together. Additionally, let's say you're planning on building a membership site that doesn't involve the parent-child add-on. We have an alternate your account page that you can use. Here you can see the option to add uh, and manage additional users is not included there. And all the links to the relevant billing settings are already all set up. With the user's image, that will pull their Gravatar image if they have one added for their email address. Here's an example of the billing history uh, past paid invoices page. 
if you click into any of the invoices, a user can view a copy of the invoice or receipt that they had paid. If it's paid, it'll have the paid green mark in the top corner, or if it's unpaid, it'll be marked red and marked unpaid. If you're selling subscriptions, you can allow your users to self-cancel their own subscriptions online. That's linked from the manager subscription option. Additionally, there's the individual course template uh, that we covered in a previous lesson, and also the individual lesson template uh, that can be easily cloned. One of the other things that Membrium allows you to do is you can add one-click Infusionsoft upsells to your WordPress site. This means if a user has an existing credit card on file with you, they can technically purchase additional products uh, by just clicking a button. If you're interested in doing this, we include a template like this that you can easily customize uh, to be able to include additional offers inside of your online course or membership area. Additionally, if you're offering tiered memberships inside of your membership program, we have an upgrade your membership uh, to continuum template that you can use to be able to do that. There's a default thank you page for when a user updates their info. Any pages where they update their info, they'll be automatically sent to this page. Likewise, there's certain error pages for specific forms. This one is added for the credit card form. If something is added incorrectly when they try to add a new credit card, there's also a failed uh, billing excerpt. Let's say if there's a billing issue and their membership gets cut off, this page will appear if they log in or attempt to access their membership and then leads them to the page where they can add a new credit card. Uh, likewise, you can also set up a custom redirect uh, that will send them to this page letting them know their membership has been canceled. If you want to allow users to upload files uh, to their Infusionsoft contact records, there's a page template that will help you be able to do that faster. Uh, we have an alternate login page if you don't like the design of the other one that's included. Going back to the default home page options, if you're using LearnDash, we recommend you use the LearnDash course grid add-on. Here's a look at what that looks like. The cool part about this shortcode is it's super easy to set up. You can see there's about seven courses that appear on the home page. Here we have only, or well, Technically, it's two short codes, but it only requires one short code to get all these courses to show up. And by default, whenever I add an additional LearnDash course, it gets automatically added to the LearnDash course grid, and it will automatically pull the featured image uh, of the course and the title there. Also, we're excited to announce with the latest release of the LearnDash course grid add-on, uh, we've worked with them to get a check mark to show up uh, when a course has been completed or if a user doesn't have access to the courses, they will appear as being locked like this. Additionally, if you're not using LearnDash or any LMS, we have a similar course grid shortcode that you can use that looks just like this. If you're using Lifter LMS and you want to set up a course grid just like that, you can do so by using our Lifter LMS course grid shortcode. Or if you'd prefer a horizontal list of courses like this, you can use our course list shortcode. Uh, there's also a blog post that walks you through all the course grid options that are available. And also additionally, if you're not using Elementor or any page builder at all, we also have similar course grid shortcodes uh, that will work with the default WordPress content editor or any other page builder as well. So that's it for what the templates look like. Moving on to how you can get these templates installed for free on your site. To get these templates, all you need to do is sign up for Membrium with the plan that you'd like to get started with. After you submit your order, you'll be taken to a quick web form where you can request these page templates to be installed on your site. So for instance, if you're interested in us having install Astro for you, you would select yes. If you'd prefer the Elementor page templates, uh, that option is there. And you would select that you want Elementor and the page templates installed and then we'll install the uh, Elementor version of the templates. Additionally, if you let us know what LMS plugin you plan on using, if you plan on using none, or LearnDash, we can install the other LearnDash specific pages or the other specific pages if you're not using LearnDash or Lifter LMS. Additionally, we'll also install Membrium for free on your site and set up some of the basic settings. This is all available for free for you. Additionally, it's also available for any existing Memberium customers. So for instance, if you don't 
set this up right away, we could set it up again for you in the future. Or if you're an existing Mimbrium customer watching this, just contact support at Mimbrium.com and let us know you'd like to have the templates installed. So that's it for how you can get the templates. Hey there, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to check out more short videos like the one you just watched, I'd like to invite you to check out our live demo membership site that's built with Memberium. Inside of this demo site, there's six short video courses that will show you how Memberium works and show you how you can use it to easily build your membership site or online course. You'll also be able to see what a membership site that's built with Memberium and what that looks like. You'll be able to find out how you can build your membership site more quickly with our pre-built templates. You'll be able to get answers to some of the most common questions that people have about Memberium and much more. To check it out and see for yourself, click the link in this post or below this video to get started.